Finding a comfortable seat, cross-legged or kneeling, beginning by rolling the shoulders up and back and down. A couple of times in one direction, and then a couple of times coming the other way, just trying to just move the shoulders, feeling that rotation. Inhaling the arms up alongside the ears, keeping the shoulders down. Exhaling, opening to one side. Inhaling up, exhaling down. Working with your breath for about 10 repetitions. Feeling the length in the side body, the twist in the middle body. Inhaling tall, exhaling, folding forward into child's pose. Sinking the hips back to the heels and the chest down to the thighs, forehead resting on the floor. Inhaling all the way up, lifting through the hips. Exhaling, folding down again. Inhaling, lifting tall. Exhale, folding forwards. Inhaling, feeling the length. Exhaling, folding down and sinking back into child's pose. Hips reaching all the way back to the heels. And then allowing the hips to come up over the knees, sinking the chest down to the mat, coming into puppy pose. Releasing the shoulders. Inhaling, coming up, lifting the right arm out to the side and threading it through under the left side Thread the needle, breathing five breaths, coming back up, switching sides, lifting the left arm, threading through under the right side, onto the left shoulder, breathing deeply, five breaths. Bringing yourself up to tabletop, bringing hands under shoulders, knees under hips, and cycling through unicorn cat, or cat cow as you may know it. Inhaling, lifting the gaze, dropping the chest, tipping the tailbone up. Exhaling, taking the gaze back to the belly button, arching the back, dropping the hips. Really feeling it through the spine. And after eight to 10 of these, Coming on to the tiptoes, lifting the hips and pushing back up into down dog. And pedaling through the back of the legs. Opening up through the side body. Sinking the chest to the thighs as you bend the knees. Taking your gaze forward, stepping that right foot up in between the hands, sinking down onto the back knee and lifting the arms up perhaps. I'm coming into my favorite cactus here. Exhaling, releasing all the tension from the hips. And twisting, bringing the right hand down inside the right foot, maybe reaching that top arm tall if it's comfortable for you. Twisting through the mid body. And switching hands, bringing the left hand down, twisting across the bent leg now. And maybe allowing that front knee to roll out if it's comfortable and available for you. Bringing both hands to the mat, stepping back into plank, exhaling, lowering down. Inhaling, lifting up, shoulders drawing away from the ears. And exhaling, back to down dog. Lifting the hips high, sinking the heels down and pushing the ground away with your hands. Looking forwards, stepping that left foot up, dropping down to the back knee and inhaling the arms up. This time I've clasped my hands together, drawn my shoulder blades in, and really puffed my chest out. But do what feels good for you and your body today. Breathing. And then bringing the left hand inside the left foot, turning your back to face the bent knee, twisting, maybe reaching tall with that top arm. And then switching hands, bringing the right hand inside the left foot, twisting to face the bent knee. And 
perhaps, if it's available, rolling out onto the side of that foot, opening the hip a little further. Bringing both hands down, stepping back into plank, elbows in, lowering the whole body down. Inhaling up, shoulders away from the ears. And exhaling back to down dog. Bending the knees, coming into plank. Exhaling, lowering down, elbows in. Inhaling up, shoulders down. And back to down dog. And repeating. Bending the knees, coming forwards into plank, exhaling shoulders down away from the ears as you inhale back to cobra and then sinking all the way back into child's pose, hips to heels and maybe bringing the arms alongside the legs, fingers to toes, breathing deeply. Carefully, gently bringing yourself up to kneeling and coming down onto your back. Arms by your sides, chin tucking in slightly to straighten through the neck and legs long. Inhaling that right leg up over the chest, hugging it in. And then taking the left hand to the outside of the right knee and allowing your body to twist right knee falling all the way over to the left side breathing keeping the shoulders down inhaling back to center and extending as much as you can through that right leg and taking hold of the back of your thigh or perhaps your calf just drawing it towards you and then bending the knee and extending the leg back to the floor noticing any difference inhaling left side bringing the left knee over the chest it in. Placing right hand on the outside of the left knee, allowing your body to twist across, fall down to the right side, keeping the shoulders down if you can. Breathing here. Inhaling back to centre, extending through the leg, kicking the heel up to the ceiling and either holding behind the thigh or the calf, drawing that leg towards you as straight as you can bending the knee and extending the leg out long. Closing the eyes, absorbing everything you've done. Bringing your attention back to your breath, maybe giving it a colour, following it in and out of your body. feet and ankles soft, calves, shins, knees heavy, thighs, bottom, hips relaxed, belly, back, chest, shoulders heavy, all the way down the arms, elbows, hands, wrists, fingers, soft, throat, neck, whole face, soft, whole body relaxed, heavy, melting into the mat. Slowly bringing your attention back to your breath again, breathing deeply, feeling the cool air of the inhale, new energy, new spaces, and the warm exhale, taking with it anything that doesn't serve you anymore. Perhaps inhaling and reaching the arms overhead, pointing through the toes, exhaling, releasing. And doing a few more if you wish, or reaching the arms out wide, finding both shoulders, giving yourself a big hug. Say thank you to you for this time. And then slowly, carefully making your way onto your right side. Making your way up to a comfortable seat, kneeling or cross-legged, 
keeping the eyes closed if you can and bringing your prayer to your heart. Reaching your prayer to your forehead, always think good thoughts. Bringing your prayer to your lips, always speak good words. And returning your prayer to your heart, always do good things. Opening your eyes.